Patrick. Oh, yes. Yeah, sure. Susan Patrick. Yes. This is lady. What is your name? Jane. Jane. First name? Jane. Jane, Jane. <laughs> <laughs> hold the box. This is good. Hold the box. Thank you. <laughs> now. <laughs> Oh, jolly good. This. I haven't seen this one myself. Let's figure out one. Okay, I know. Card trick. Card trick. Packet cards. Packet cards all completely different. Now, Jane, <clears throat> I shall remove one card out of the pack. Can you name for me any card you like in a pack? Anyone at all? Uh, four of clubs. Four clubs. <laughs> now it's the four hearts. Oh. That was what I was thinking of, the four parts. Okay, that's okay. Four, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's worked one in every 300 times. It's actually worked great. If I tell you that, it's four parts. It's, 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 yeah, anyway, the four hearts. Okay, we'll try somebody else. Let's try the um, gentleman here, sir. Name any card you like in the pack. Jack and Diamonds. It's going to be a long show, this. <laughs> Correct. Okay. Now, <laughs> now, your card, the Jack of Diamonds, is embedded somewhere in the center of the pack. We shall flip the cards once, twice, three times. And your card, sir, the Jack of Diamonds, is now on the top of the pack. But ladies and gentlemen, to make this not just a great trick, but to turn it into a miracle, not only is your card risen to the top of the pack, at the same time it has changed into the three <laughs> Thank you so much. Okay. Yeah, that one. You like that one? Yeah, yeah, very good. Okay, how about you? Like rope tricks? You like rope tricks? I'm all up with this. Okay. Two bits of rope. What color is this one? Red. This one? White. Shall we use the red one or shall we use the white one? Red. red. Excellent. We're going to use the white one. It's a magician's choice. Doesn't work the other way around. Seriously. Okay, we're going to make a little knot like that in the rope. So we pull the end through like that. So we have a knot right there in the center of the rope. I want you, ladies and gentlemen, to watch that knot. Keep watching that knot. Do not look at the red rope. Don't look at the red rope. <laughs> Mrs. Lady, I'm seeing you looking at the, 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 the. What is your name? Casey. Hello, Casey. Hello, dear Casey. <laughs> Perfect. Okay, that's okay. But watch that. I'm just sorry, no cheating. Okay, I want you to watch that. Watch that. Watch that. Don't look at the red rope. Do not look at the red rope. Watch the white one there. Okay. In fact, what we're going to do is we are going to make it, ladies and gentlemen. This gets a bit harder. Into a into a Christmas candy cane, or maybe it's a barber's pole. As we taught them, buzz, 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 buzz. keep watching the white one at all times. Keep watching the white. <laughs> ah! Oh my goodness. Did I scare you? This must be a magic knot. In fact, it's such a magic knot, ladies and gentlemen. We can take the knot like this, and we can pull it like this all the way down the rope. All the way off the end of the rope and back there onto the rope. <laughs> you can clap any time you like. <laughs> you can take some magic dust. Magic, magic, magic dust as we pull it from one end of the rope like that all the way down there to the other end of the rope and we pull it from the other end of the rope like that all the way down there to the one end of the rope. In fact, it's such a special knot, ladies and gentlemen, we can actually take the knot like that, we can pull it like that, throw it up there over the proscenium arch. Do you know what that is? A proscenium arch. The actual thespian language with a T. <laughs> <laughs> And he lands back over there like that. You see, Thank you. Now, the thing about this knot is he thinks he's a slip knot, but he's not. He's part of the rope. Look, you see, he's the white part, and that's the red part, and I'm very clever. Thank you very much. There we are. What's your name, little guy? What's your name? Excuse me? 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 You're going to like this one, me. Funny enough, I've never had a kid call me before. Okay. Now, really, has to be really good. Look, look, I'll show you. You're not impressed, you're not impressed, okay? And he goes, right. Ah, there we are. What about that? Magic! Wine. Here we are. Cheers. Mm. <sighs> I made a prediction, ladies and gentlemen, which I placed right here inside this envelope. Now, young lady down here, I want you to answer me yes or no. Do you know what is written inside this envelope? Uh, no. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> and I want the pen, just in case. <laughs> oh, okay. 
Yeah. What about this? This is this is good. Let's try. Let's try this. Um, try, my card tricks seem to go down rather well earlier on, so we'll try this. Um, we'll try this one. Another little card trick. Can we ask him, Mrs. Lady? We've not met before, have we? Can you can you just hold on to that envelope for me, please? In fact, put it behind your like behind your back. Behind your back. By that, that's perfect. Wonderful. Right. Okay. Is this your husband? Are you together? Okay. Your brother. Hello, brother. Nice to see you, brother. Okay. I believe that. Right. Great. Okay. So, <laughs> so what we're going to do, brother? <laughs> Seriously. Okay, what we're gonna do, what's your name, sir? Richard. Richard, okay. I'm gonna flip through the cards, I want you just to say stop any way you like. Yeah, you're gonna be a little bit quicker than that. Here we go. Stop. Now I haven't started yet. Can we try you instead? Okay. Uh, we'll try your, 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 is it your little sister or your big sister? Big sister. Big sister. We'll start try big sister. Too. Older, not baby. <laughs> Excuse me. Would you mind helping me with this great one? Well, Robert says I'm going over anyway on time. So, I, so what's your name, sir? Adam. First one, excellent. So just say stop and we like sensible fellow. Perfect. Perfect. Now have a look at the card, you stop. Have a look at the card. Have a look at it. You show it everybody out there in the audience. I do not want to see the card, okay? Place it back there in the pack. This is what major. This is great. Okay, now, this is what we're gonna do, ladies and gentlemen. We are gonna shuffle the card, but I'm not going to tell you what that card is in the normal way that magicians do. I'm going to introduce you to my assistant here. We say, have you an assistant? Yes, I have. This is Griselda, the duck. <laughs> Now, Griselda, ladies and gentlemen, is in fact, you're still holding on to that uh, envelope, right? This, this Griselda is in fact a mind reading duck. A mind reading duck is Griselda. And what Griselda is going to do is she's going to pick your card out of the pack, out of the pack, and this will amaze you. But to make it even more amazing, she's such a special and clever duck, we are going to blindfold the duck. <laughs> that she is able to cheat. Seriously. This is good stuff. Stephen Sandoval, you'll have no idea how this works. Now, we shall blindfold the duck, so. So here we go now, this is really good. She's gonna pick your card out of the pack. Trying to cheat. Okay. Yes. Stupid duck. Okay. Sorry about the blindfold. She's she's done it without. There we are. The queen of spades. Is that your card? Is that your card? No. Stupid duck. Okay, here we go. Ten of clubs. <laughs> the interval's coming up soon. Here we go. <laughs> Quinn of clubs. <laughs> See any of your luck? <laughs> I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, look. Hang on a minute. Can we just have that envelope, please? Can we have the envelope? I'm going to do a different trick. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, very good. Right now, um, at this point, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to ask you to please name the card that you chose. Name the card. Four. You a ventriloquist? No. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck did you know it was a four? She said, "Where got that four?" Okay. So if I was to open it, this you're a stupid duck. <laughs> <laughs> if I was to open this envelope. And show you that the four hearts was in the air, you'd be pretty impressed, right? Oh, oh yes. Yeah. Yeah. Seriously, four hearts would be look. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> but we have a, a card here. Can you see that in the back? And if you look down here, you'll see, no, it's this way around. You'll see one, two, three, four hearts. <laughs> You're not impressed? Well, how about that then? Oh, <laughs> 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 Ha 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 